Sally. So I found the boss, Jordan Murphy, prepping for this afternoon's training session here at Leicester Tigers. Jordy, last year was fairly traumatic for Leicester in terms of head coaches, but you were the head coach uh, of the Anglo-Welsh. You end up winning it. Good times? Fantastic experience. Um, you know, we managed to blood some young players and got a real buy-in from, from a lot of the lads, and they, uh, you know, we never expected to, to go and win it. Um, we sort of took it one game at a time, as we will do this season, but uh, on the whole, it was, a, it was a great experience winning it. What is Jordan Murphy like as a head coach? Now, I know you as a mate. Um, and seeing how head coaches have reacted over the years. What are you like with all the lads in there, the youngsters as well? Um, you know, I think you've kind of got to take a little bit of a feel for what you've learned throughout your career and, and you know, things that you've seen other coaches do and effectively it's, a, yeah, it's stealing or borrowing. So for me, you know, I like to be very serious when we're on the field, similarly to the way we played, but, but uh, yeah, off the field I like the guys to be relaxed. You're the first guy probably to be a player, win it as a player and a head coach. Um, talk to me about the, the old, old days in the competition when we won. Oh, it was obviously a lot easier when you were playing Goody and uh, yeah, yeah, you just you know gave us a uh, easy tries. I suppose we were young once. It doesn't feel like it now, but you know we, we got opportunities to go out and play in it. Uh, I think the the 11 final was a um, was an interesting one. I can remember that clearly as a player. You know, one of, and last season I think was probably more special than, than both of them. Uh, yeah, good stuff. Well, thanks very much, mate. Good luck for the weekend. Very welcome. And Thank hopefully you. you can defend your title. Cheers, mate. Thank you.